This is Inside CSUSB, your number one source of all things Cal State San Bernardino. CSUSB had its most successful homecoming as about 2,500 students, alumni, faculty, staff, and community members attended the festivities. During the festivities, the CSUSB Honors Program held an open house to celebrate its 30th anniversary. Earlier in the day, Alumni Affairs and Admission and Recruitment hosted CSUSB Snapshot. Members of the Pan-African Alumni Chapter joined with faculty, staff, and students to meet with about 30 underrepresented high school juniors and seniors, specifically African American students, and their families. They discussed what CSUSB offers prospective students and how it helps make the transition to college effortless. Later, CSUSB Preview saw more than 600 high school juniors, seniors, and transfer students tour campus, meet with faculty, and attend workshops about campus resources. That evening, more than 1,200 people attended the CSUSB volleyball match at Casulas Arena, where the top-ranked Coyotes swept their conference rivals, the Cal Poly Pomona Broncos, 3-0. Closing out the homecoming festivities, outdoor telescopes were set up at the Murillo Family Observatory. About 750 students took the first step to walking in the 2019 winter commencement by taking part in Glad Days at the Coyote Bookstore. Prospective graduates were able to purchase their cap and gown, pose for grad pictures taken, and have their commencement questions answered. CSUSB will hold a series of events throughout November as part of Native American Heritage Month, celebrating the rich histories, diverse cultures, and important contributions of our nation's first people. The events include the Coyote Learning Circle, a performance of the play Mental and Her Heart, and a talk by Native American artist, activist, and educator Charlene Teeters. William Shakespeare's classic, Twelfth Night, will launch the theater department's new season. Directed by department chair Terry Donovan Smith, the production is a contemporary take on the Bard's romantic comedy of twins separated during a shipwreck. The San Bernardino American News reported that the book, Safe and Peaceful Schools, Addressing Conflict and Eliminating Violence, co-written by John Winslade, a lecturer in the Special Education Rehabilitation and Counseling Department, is being used as a resource by the San Bernardino City Unified School District in its Bully Prevention Month. Barbara Surotnik, an information and decision sciences professor and director of the Institute of Applied Research and Policy Analysis, was quoted by Connect California on a story on the Inland Empire's Purchasing Managers Index dropping for the third consecutive month. CSUSB President Tomas Morales welcomed to campus K-12 college and other education-focused partners from throughout the region to kick off College Next Inland Empire for the California College Guidance Initiative, which works to ensure California students have access to guidance and support as they plan, prepare, and pay for college and post-secondary training. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again at the next edition of Inside CSUSB. Ooh.